What's going on everybody? Rob here, Trev 2323, that's T-R-E-V 2323. Subscribe, like, and share. I'm doing my video because I lost all my data on my backup drive. I had a four terabyte backup drive. This is another brand new four terabyte drive, but this is a desktop one. This is my old laptop. It's a Experian 15 3000 series. This is about four or five years old, still making me money, so I'm still using it. You know me, I am cheap, 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 cheap. I will use everything until I suck the life out of it. So this is a 500 gig. It's going to get backed up on this one. Meanwhile, well, my other drive is getting fixed. This is a one terabyte maxed out also. But what happened is I the, the little clip, the little plug-in that you went in here, actually went bad. It'll fire up. It'll spin. But the computer won't find it because apparently there's some cables in here that power it and that send the data. Well, when this comes loose, the little wires break, all right? So even though I had the two-year warranty on this through one of the big box stores, the warranty only covers the replacement of this. It does not cover data backup. So how did I get my data back? Well, I haven't yet, so here's the process I went to to start that process. I've been looking online with Western Digital. I've been using them for a while, and I like their products. This right here is really my fault because I traveled with the thing in here, and it went off kilter, and that's what broke the lines in here, all right? So I was honest when I took it back to the store and everything. Uh, Western Digital gives you places to call to try to get your data back. Data recovery is apparently a big business. If you're going to go to school, heck, if I'm going to school, I'm going back to school for data recovery. Data recovery through the services that they, they offered, it started at $700. $700 and it goes up to $2,700. Yes, I did say $2,700. Develop your pictures. Don't put them on here. Develop your pictures. Because, you know, I mean, it's just insane to lose that many pictures. And I don't even know what else is on the drive. I really, really, really don't, but I want it. So since I had the warranty which covered this, I went to the big box store that I bought this from and all my electronics from, and they said theirs was Best Buy. I'll say it's Best Buy. They say it's $50 for them to send this out to their company, but they have their own P place in Kentucky that tries to data recover. Now online somebody says don't use them, somebody says that they couldn't do theirs, but just because they can't, everything has a different scenario. So I sent mine and paid the $50. Now theirs is going to be between $250 to $1,600 to get your data, depending upon the data that you need, and it takes two to three or two to four weeks. Meanwhile, this is maxed out and this is maxed out and I don't got my other drive. Oh, that's the other thing also, seeing that it, I did have the warranty, if they do can recover the data, it was under warranty, they're just going to send me the other WD 4 terabyte drive with my data back on there. So that actually is pretty cool. So meanwhile, I have to make YouTube videos and upload and I have no space on here, so I bought another 4 terabyte bookshelf drive. And why did I get the bookshelf drive? Because hopefully the cord's longer where I can leave the cord plugged in to the drive, not have to move it, and just use the USB one. That's what I'm going to go for for now. I almost bought another Dell because I use Dell for all my YouTube videos. I stick with the same thing. The Western Digital is what I use, so I already have Western Digital software. Canon's camera is what I use. I have all Canon software, so I stick with Canon. Dell, when I'm going to get my laptop, I was looking at another one today. It was 549. I just couldn't commit to it. <laughs> but either way, I kind of stick with all the same things so it all kind of meshes together. But either way, I wanted to tell you about data recovery and warranties and these little things only cover the replacement of it. So if you're looking for data recovery and you thought I was going to show you about data recovery, that really didn't happen. But I gave you a little bit more insight on it. All right. Either way, thanks for watching. Subscribe, like, and share. Bye-bye.